And just like that, we are back with some more car manufacturer. The Wagon Supra not released yet. The Silver Bullet not released yet. Uh, currently, right now, being built as we stand. So today, I would like to add assembly stations. More assembly stations to all of our lines. Well, hang on a sec. <laughs> maybe build up this assembly station first. And then maybe, maybe, maybe. We'll see where we get Towards the back end of the episode, maybe start adding more assembly stations to uh, all of this going on right here. Um, yeah, it should be just more or less, more, 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 more station, station, station. However, over here, we are filling up our parking lot. We are at $66,000. Uh, I will send that off to the uh, repair. Let's check on all the cars before I release. But so far, so good. Uh, so far, so good. Uh, let me see. Good, 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 good. Excellent, good, decent. I guess I could send that off too. Uh, how are we doing on the other cars currently at the moment? I think they're coming out. They're doing their thing. Uh, they're at some sort of, you know, speed. I'm not too really worried about it, honestly. Uh, it, it is it is a weird thing, but I'm not too, too weird. Like, like we have so many cars coming out anyways. Like... As long as we get cars on the lot, that's money in the pocket, and I'm for it. So, yeah. This is poor, by the way. This is excellent. Okay, let's go ahead and release uh, this. So, this is going to be a $1,500 car for the Wagon Supra. And this is going to be a $1,800 car for the uh, Silver Bullet. Now, I'm saying income. I'm saying, like, actual, like, um, like positive income, not, like, the sale price. So we'll release both of those. They will go directly right onto uh, onto sales now. I'm gonna come over here, and I'm gonna start working on this brand new line, and this will give us an additional um, car to work with. Which I'm hoping. You know what I should do? I should just let time go. I'm gonna let time go in the background. Maybe at like a two speed. We'll go at like a two speed as you know things are happening. Well, the time go in the background so that we are, you know, making some money and research is being done. Most importantly, there we are. This should fit. We should be a okay. Uh, so we have what on that side. Okay. So let's go. Boom, 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 and boom. Let me take a look at our money. $73,000 looking pretty good. Feeling pretty good. There we are. Excuse me. The only thing that's going to really trouble us a bit is them walking in front of us as we're trying to put down a toolbox and whatnot, but it's fine. It's fine. There, there, and there. Now, this is actually going to be quite interesting to see. I think uh, the dogs might bark here in a sec. I apologize for your ears. Brace your ears because um, their mother is about to walk in through the uh, in through the door right about now. Oh, she walked in quiet. Oh, they don't even know. They don't even know. Oh, yeah, we were going to finish up uh robots i think also on these i know i'm getting kind of sidetracked already but i'm gonna go ahead and finish up robot there robot there robot there robot there and then i think those were the only two right yeah those were the only ones that we were missing we're right there now we're gonna come back down here we're gonna start filling this in boom boom let me just go ahead and unpause it there we are watch our money go down but then watch our money go straight up our power consumption is now in the negative so we got to put down a generator all over again you might nails yes you hear the nails i do too storage on the side here now this is quite interesting <laughs> technically this is a smaller storage but that's okay why is it okay because it's only uh, it's only um cap the capacity for this is only for one car it's not taking two cars from this so like these big ones here there's technically two cars in there this one will only have one car so it's okay so we're going to use the big wide medium shell for this and i could use two i could use two and i probably will i'll use two now as far as the ai pathing goes and how they're going to like store all these things i have no idea i don't know what they're going to do i don't know how they're going to do it i'm just going to watch them do it okay great uh, so that's all taken care of. Let me go into the back here and throw down a generator, if possible. Where is that under? Is that under here? Generator. Let's go to there. Let's throw down that. Make sure it's facing the right direction. There we go. We're back up into the green now for energy. Awesome. And now we need to figure out what car to put on here. I kind of, I don't know. I. This is a tough one. 
because I could do like the other, what is it? The, the town car, which is like the other highest tier car we have, or I could wait until we have, uh, this car, <laughs> but it's at 45%. So yeah, that took a long time. It took a whole long time for that to come in. So maybe what I do is I just bring in the town anyways. So we're going to go with the town. There we go. We could do like duplicate car lines, I guess, if we wanted to. But that just sounds boring. And then we're going to adjust our stations real quick. Okay, so we're going to go chassis. There we go. Down to engine. There we go. And then I just got to use this as reference quite a bit because I tend to forget. Steering down to electrical. Fuel down to fenders. And all this stuff is going to be eventually adjusted probably maybe today when I... Um, add the other assembly stations uh bumpers down to windows bumpers down to windows and panels down to doors panels down to doors great okay uh that's good now all we need to do is start you know spending money to bring this stuff in uh before i do that actually i'm gonna come back over here i just realized we're not gonna be able to sell this car are we hang on a sec time out we only have six sales spots and only six spinning things. So I guess we can only have six different cars. I never, I actually didn't take this into consideration, believe it or not. Um, so this one might have to be a dupe, right? Cause our tech tree is all out, right? Allows you to build more sales slots. We are at our max capacity in sales slots. So yeah, I guess this is going to have to be a dupe. And what we could do is we could just make this into the runs since they are right next to each other anyways. I don't know how I like, I don't know how I feel about that because the runs is like the lowest tier car that we have anyways. But those two lines working next to each other just seems like the right formula. We could add like a silver bullet, obviously. Uh, be worked on here and we can produce silver bullets even more i think i'm just gonna do the runs i guess and then when the blue car is done in research this car the blue car will take over the runs that's what we're gonna do yeah okay all right so we'll run this back on 60 percent order in and we can fill this thing to the max because we don't need to worry about any other stuff going into this or into this pallet so we'll go almost to 150 and then here, no. Then here, go up to 60%. And again, all the way up to 150, uh, 150 quantities. And it's going to be pricey at first, but it should be okay after. There, 146. Bunk, place the order there. Come over here, do 60%. Also place the order. Go, go, go. These are bigger parts. Let's go there. 43. Go here. And then we'll do the robots and all that here in a sec. Yeah, so I guess what we'll have to do is we'll just have to duplicate. There will be an assembly line that will just be duped all the time. All the time, all the time. And I guess that is good. I'm not, I don't know if I'm going to go to 150 on this. Let me just do 50. Uh, 50 actual quantities. I guess that's good because if there's like a very like popular car, like the next car that's like super big, right? Like, you know, the highest tier car. Maybe this, these two lines over here will be that. They will be the high tier cars. Sorry, highest tier car that we can possibly get. And then we can mass produce that twice times two. Right? I think that's a good idea. This will be our section where we get the high tier cars out even more. Now, the only problem here is we could possibly run into parking lot troubles. Possibly. And if that happens, um, I do not have a plan for that right now. <laughs> it's kind of just, let's see what happens. Uh, let's continue this. Sorry. And then let's go here. Did I press play on this? I did. Okay. Are these okay? Are you doing okay? Yeah, you're doing okay, right? You're being filled up. Are you being filled up? I think you are being filled up. You're on 100%. Yeah. Okay. 
fill you up 100 percent so the i i have gotten to realize robots are super efficient when they only need to do one task uh when they have to do multiple tasks that's when they become like not as efficient i've learned that i i i i i see it with my own eyes right i see it you definitely want them to do like one thing at a time these robots but right now we're doing multiple things at a time because we just don't have enough assembly stations as it is right now so until that time comes this is what they're gonna have to do 100 percent whoops okay 100 percent because really what we have going on like this line and this line this line and this line they can only do a car like one at a time because they can only get one of the type of parts in there at a time into their basket unlike these ones like this one this one can get a ton of parts into its basket at once there we go but that will change when we start breaking it up and whatnot once we start breaking up the and getting more assembly stations that will all change eventually there we go there we are okay sounds good to me get that going how much money do we have Forty-four thousand. yeah feeling pretty good six there we go and six cool all right so once everything starts getting stocked up in this line this line should be ready to go we should be seeing that at full force i still don't understand the whole like pathing thing with the with the ai some of them go over the conveyor belt some of them some of them don't it's very weird it's very odd um hopefully that will they will fix the ai pathing eventually but i just find it very strange how they're like behaving a bit uh decent let's go and send that in for repairs decent let's send that in for repairs very good we'll keep that out uh, okay, yeah. All right. So I'm happy about everything. Uh, money is coming in. Doing good. Parts are coming out or going out, being built. Run, the runs will soon be done here. Um, we will probably start looking into... Possibly. Let's see. Well, we don't have mechanics on this, do we? We don't have mechanics. Start splitting up mechanics a bit. Maybe I'll take one from each. We'll start depositing them into this new line. There we go. Take that out. Take that out. Take that out. Take that out. And take that out. And then we'll come over here. And then every single line has six mechanics on it, no matter what. So we have that going transporters i could get rid of mechanics and hire more transporters or i could just train up our transporters now let's look into that let's go into transporters and let's see what we have here uh a lot of people doing stuff a lot of people resting a lot of people uh transporting now it doesn't really matter i guess maybe choose the ones that are resting and we'll send for training now this is going to do a lot of how would you say this is going to stop a lot of production by putting a bunch of people on training. Is it a good idea to put them all on training at the same time? No, but apparently that's what I'm doing. Um, but yeah, this is going to stop a lot of production because believe it or not, transporters are like the lifeline of this game, <laughs> which is so strange, but they are. They're like the, they're, they're the lifeline, right? They are the lifeline. We need the transporters all the time so that we can get the cars out, get the parts in, it would be different, right, if they made another character. What if they made a character where they were, like, parking lot attendant or something like that, where their sole job as parking lot attendant was to take the car from the factory to the parking lot, take the car from the factory to the repair shop, take the car from the factory to the scrap yard. If there was a dedicated position for that, that would be nice, right? And that would change the game quite a bit, actually. The fact that the transporters have to do the car moving for when they are in the parking lot, for when they need to go to the repair shop, for when they need to go to the scrapyard, whatever it might be, and they have to take this stuff from the train to the uh, to the pallets, like that's a lot of walking 
and going around for the transporter. So if there was like maybe an, an usher, an employee, something like that, a parking lot attendee that took care of the cars that need to be driven around the lot, that would be sick. Uh, but I'm just like wishing, I guess, at this point. Anyways, uh, yeah, production for the runs should hopefully start soon. Um, yeah, that's all I got is hopefully it starts soon. We can kind of keep our eye on it and see what they're doing. But I think it's just a, um, I think it's just a, a materials thing right now. I think we just, we just don't have all the stuff in yet. Not yet, but we have so much money. 75,000. Yeah. And we are training. Uh, people are going in and it, I don't know. Production might have slowed up a bit, possibly. But the transporter's going away. Uh, let's see. Transporters, training, resting, resting. I'm trying to put all the people that are resting, try to put them on train, uh, training. Richard Lewis. There we go. Oh, what is this? What is this? Do they have a mod? Oh, no, they were training. Sorry. Yeah, plus there's these mod things that I don't think any of these mod things are actually in the game yet. I don't think they are. I think they probably will be in the game later. They're just not here. Because it's interesting. I, I, I want to know like what kind of mods you can get for your employees and whatnot. There you go. All right. Well, we're training the transporters. And ideally, you get their strength up. What do they do? I think they carry more stuff at a time is what that what happens there. All right. All right. Okay. Good, good, good. 74,000. And again, I guess the one thing I could do is just start throwing assembly stations down. Now, before I do that, though, I want to actually kind of see if I can get to the max assembly station line before I start throwing them down. Because once I do it, I don't want to do it again, right? So this takes us to 20. 20 max conveyor belts. Holy hell. Uh, what does this do? Research computer. We can get better research in. Okay, let's get a research computer in real quick before we start messing around with other stuff. So we can throw a research computer in here. Let's do it. Uh, research, research, research there. I'm looking for computer. Computer. Maybe having multiple computers are good. Yes, yes. I don't even know where the researchers are, man. They're doing their own thing. What else can we do with this money? Uh, we can't go to the next level, right? Because we need to reach the blueprint tier 10, I guess. Uh, what is this? Allows you to build more research stations. I mean, yeah, but we don't really have any capacity for it. Uh, what is this? Uh, research grinder into a research drill. Okay, let's upgrade. Okay, let's get a research drill in, apparently. Research drill. What the hell? Oh, grinder drill. Okay, I see. Drill. There. <laughs> Go to town on it, big guy. All right. What else do we have? Uh, increase the impact of brand on popularity growth. Unlock advertisements useful for increasing cars demand out of the factory's popul popularity. I mean, yeah, more of this is fine. For when we drop the new cars. Promotional objects. Increase the cells, like with a small poster. Yeah, I guess we could do that too. What about over here? What's happening over here? What is this? Unlocks objects which allow transporters to gain proficiency in their job. So the employment period upgrade. Let's do that. And then let's go to employees. Yes. What's it called? Employment period. Useful for high level transporter training. Employment period is them banging on drums. What are you talking about? The Soku band. Okay odd <laughs> very odd sure i guess on days that end with y possibly i'm very worried now about this production here this line that we have going on here they have orders they have the capacity Right? 
they have their stuff they're just not working on it right their orders are in they have the parts i'm pretty sure right i'm pre yeah i'm pretty sure sorry content no they don't have the parts they just haven't received the parts yet so it's still on order right place order they just haven't gotten it in yet wow there must be a lot of like resources that are like trying to do this and catch up to this stuff instead of like doing this quite yet maybe this is like backlogged the uh resources it's a bit janky i think i just dropped my phone it's a bit janky you just really have to wait i guess right i don't think there's like a high priority where you can like prioritize an order i think you just gotta leave it be i think you do oh there they go is there some stuff right there yeah there it is Okay, now they have some stuff see they're getting stuff in slowly but it's taking a very long time and i think it's just because they're backed up on orders let's see and i think this is this is the point that i'm also trying to make like i think there should be another employee for transporting stuff like transporting the cars they're getting backed up and if they could just focus on resources that would be wonderful and then just have somebody else deal with the car right I think the fact that they are having to deal with the car as well is just really throwing off everyone. It's making things slower, is what it's doing. Send you in. There you go. Send you in. Yeah, it's just making things slower. Look at that. There it is. There's the runs. Now fully, like, in its, like, self here. Yeah, the orders are just not catching up. We're just at the point where we are just, like, I guess... We are demanding way too much for the game to like, like. They're like, oh, you're ordering way too much stuff. We don't like that. Okay, all right. Yeah, we can't do that upgrade. Um, paint station, we could do that, but I just don't find I really need to do it. Uh, security installation. I don't think there's people robbing in this game quite yet. Go ahead and unlock all that stuff. And I don't know if I can actually unlock any of this quite yet. Hire a researcher. We need five researchers. No. We'll buy the quick sell scrapping thing, I guess. Get all that done. Increase our base popularity. I guess we'll do that too. We're kind of just like, we have all this money to spend. We're just kind of just spending it all. Um, yeah. Popularity growth. We'll do that too adds popularity boost yep yeah, we'll do that too what is this the, the sales object yeah more popularity boost sure more money being spent i mean we almost have everything unlocked in this game at least for where it stands right now except for like the rest objects like we could have a toilet if we want but really i think they're fine um get this Increase the popularity on those. Thank you very much. What about over here? Oh yeah, blueprints, uh, research. I'll just upgrade this while I'm at it. And a big poster, sure, why not? There, okay, we're at $3,000. But we're still selling cards like cars like it's nobody's business. That's right. Because our brands are super popping right now super super popping the runs coming in hot i mean what we could do is i kind of want to save real quick let me save let me save i'm gonna save and what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna try something risky here i'm gonna go to pause i'm gonna go to mechanics and i'm gonna do two mechanics per line there's six mechanics right now right i'm gonna do two mechanics per line let's see where that takes us what do you think and then the remaining people 
we'll make we'll turn into um transporters so one let's see one two three four five six seven so 14 transporters sorry 14 mechanics need to stay i don't know how many we have so far so i'm going from bottom to top because of the strength numbers i think one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen wow oh, frick me fourteen okay they'll be fired when they're done on completion of task once they are gone we will then hire a mass amount of transporters and see if that will help our resources a bit because really the only thing we're waiting on is resources that's it that's the only thing that's like holding up the train right now is resources and i guess we don't need that many more mechanics now that we are you know we have so many um robots and we're going to continue to have more robots eventually it's a sad sad day isn't it okay so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen okay 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 everybody else below get canned And then we'll start pumping in and you can even pump in a couple of new researchers so if we want to but we'll start mostly pumping in um yeah we'll start pumping in brand new transporters there we go and this should hopefully help our resource a bit resources there we go there we go and then i'm gonna have to reassign these um I'm going to have to reassign the, uh, uh, the lines here with mechanics. We're going, what is it? We're going, uh, we're going transport crazy right now. Transport heavy. This could be a bad idea. This could be a good idea. That's why I saved. So we're going to see how it actually pans out here. Gosh, darn dude. So many of them. I just want to hire threes all day. Okay, let me oh, there's a three here's a three let me see here let me come back to that in a sec let me make sure these have at least okay what the hell six six i'm sorry zero okay yeah yeah you guys have to share <laughs> okay, you have two now you have two okay you have two you have two you have two. You have two. You have two. You already have two. You have four. What the frick is happening? Two? Did I say four on each? No, I said two on each. Two there. 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 Okay, I, there must be there. Oh, there must be some that are finishing up, right? Finishing up their job. That's right. Finishing up completion before they get fired. Got it. Okay. That's all I can really think of. Unless I just miscounted. No, there's fourteen. We see fourteen. It's a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, fourteen. There should be two on every on each one. The hell's happening? Am I miscounting? Two? Two. 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 Yeah, I don't know. But there's 14 altogether. So that's nice. Okay, even more transporters are in. Bump, bump, bump. I can go to 95. We're going to figure out. We're going to see how this goes, man. We're going to see if this is a good idea or not. I'm hoping it is. Because I feel like the it's just the resources, right? The resources are, are, are falling behind. Okay, now look at all these sons of guns. Holy hell. Um, 
we'll hold off on the five additional we'll see where we're at right now because i can add more researchers if i want to instead or i could just go super heavy and just go everybody is a transporter now maybe i should just do that let's just go super heavy everybody's a transporter now and research will stay where research is stay in your own lane research right yeah there we go okay we're back at 100 employees now 77 transporters and it does look like things are being filled up right now stuff being filled there filled there filled the robots are being filled everything seems to be now being uh becoming filled okay very good decent uh decent cars are coming out that's what matters decent decent now the frame rates really dropping because i think of how many people is running around in the lot now especially how many transporters send that decent decent poor hey, subscriber thank you for subscribing dylan welcome in welcome in okay okay there we go all right so now how is everything functioning as a whole as a whole probably pretty good i'm gonna take a screenshot for the thumbnail don't mind me there we go okay this is crazy dude this is insane <laughs> it's working though this is working the first line's working cars are being moved in on these two lines cars are taking a little bit of a stutter here on this line but i think it just needs to catch up a bit there you go Cars are going super fast on here. Cars are going fast on here. Cars are going fast on here. Look, all the cars, they get built at different speeds, right? Anyways, some take longer than others. Some are quicker than others, right? Yeah. Everybody's the everybody's the same. Everybody's not the same. Everybody's different in bed. There's a 10 second guy. There's a 10 minute guy. There's a 10 hour guy. All right. We're working our best over here. There we go. It's looking good, though. By the way, oh, <laughs> the DeVille. It's going to be the DeVille. The DeVille is in. We officially, officially have the DeVille. So what I'm going to do, I guess, is bring in the DeVille. I guess, right? We're going to have to. A beautiful looking car. Oh, look at that car even better. Oh, I love it. It looks so good. Looks really, really good. It looks really good. Now, I am curious if I were to fill this out with the additional assembly station. So we have all the assembly sta stations that, that we can possibly get. It's all maxed out, right? Um, so uh, does it tell us how many can be on a line? How many things are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. There's about 22. 20 stations can fit on online. Let's say we have uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This is going to be our guinea pig here. Okay, hang on. This is going to take some focus. Okay. Uh, so that would be... What would that be? Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And then we would have to back this out. Right? Add more line. Back it out. More line. Back it out. More line. Bag it out. More line. Bag it, bag it, bag it out. Now, if I'm going to do 20, I'm going to have to like smash some in between. Right? It's not going to be perfect. And then we'll go that to that. But I do wonder how much of a difference this would make. 
probably a massive one, right? I mean, our money is very, very good right now. I'm sorry. There you go. Yeah. Um, that would be a lot of... Probably a lot of... Ro like, robots might be blazing through all this. Right? They would be. They'll be blazing through that. Especially when they only have to do, like, maybe one job at a time for certain... For some of them, right? There we go. There we are. Perfect. Kind of just run this line through. I don't know how this is going to work. It's going to be interesting. We almost have $100,000, by the way. We almost have $100,000, and I think it's because we have all these cars coming out. And it has to, like, really do because of the, like, incredible transporters. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. But this is not fully 20. This is not 20 stations. Is 20 stations necessary? Do we need to have 20 stations? Maybe. There we go. This is ridiculous. <laughs> I'm telling you, dude. This is absolutely ridiculous. Now, I could... Give them even more room for one more station each. If I chose to. I kind of want to get rid of that door. Why do... There's no need... With the door right there those generators are clipping through the building okay now all you really have to do cans is just fill in the blanks i guess and sure fill in the blanks i shall there we go and i guess we can see how this goes Add the stuff to it. Sorry. Boom, 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 boom. We have over a hundred. Oh, God. We have over a hundred thousand dollars. I think we're doing just fine. Okay, let's see. Let's take a look at everything. How's our parking lot doing? I mean, we're selling cars. It, I, and honestly, I think it's our popular. What is it called? The uh, The brand advertising popularity thing. Yeah, it's that thing. That thing is probably instantly selling these cars as soon as they touch the parking lot. Right? Like, look at the hype. A thousand hype for the runs. Never been hyped up for defecate, defecation in my life. I mean, everybody's hyped up for it. They love it. Um. Okay, let's go to assembly now. There we go. We'll work on one line at a time here. I don't want to overdo it. I just... I, the only thing I'm afraid of with doing this is I'm very, like, nervous about the AI pathing. I think the AI pathing is just not doing what it needs to do. I just don't think it's correct. That's all I got to say about that. I, it's, just, it's just acting weird. It is. It is. It's acting super weird right now. And you can see how they're, like, all the way over here, right? That's, I, I feel like that's not how they should be working, but whatever. There, 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 there. Now, the incredible micromanaging is about to come into play here. Especially when it comes to, like, what parts and what thing is worked on at what time, right? Oh, God. Okay. Here we go. Our, we're going to need more power, too. Um... <laughs> Yeah, about this. This is awkward, huh? Oh, look at all those things now. Oh, shoot, right? I know. Yeah. So we're going to make up our brand new work priority. Brand new. It's going to be sick, dude. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just do two of those. Holy crap. Um... Two of those. Now, they go fast. That's why I'm doing two of them. Um, let's do that. 
And then let's separate the body frames individually. I think that's a good call. Oh, God. Jesus. Okay, that's a good call. Separate the body frames individually. Work on the bumper. Uh, you can work on the lights. Sorry, that. One on the wheels. One on the door. One on the hood. One on panels and trunks. Okay. That's going to be our line up there. Two people on this line all together. And all we need to do is fill in the blanks now. This is going to take a while. Uh, get me on 60%. And push in... I don't know, dude. Push in as many as you want, I guess. Push in 25. Thank you. You. Push in... 60%. Pushing a crap ton. I don't know. Maybe pushing 25. I guess 25. If we keep the um, quantities the same. I mean, they can only make as many as there are a pieces. So 25, 25, 25. We'll just do 25 down the whole, uh, whole shoot here. 25. Do 25 again on a reorder of 60. And then you, 25. I am very interested to see how this is going to play out. I want to see it play out the entire, like, line. Whoops, I went over 25. 25? I really am. I'm really, really curious. Kind of excited. Because if it can just, like, run super fast, super smooth... Oh, dude, that's that's everything we've ever dreamed of. Thank you. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? I'm sorry. No. No, no, no. No, I want you working on this. No, no, no. I want you working on this. What is this? What is this? What is this line? What line is this? Can I see which line this is? You give me that uh, uh, possibility? This should be a station up in here, right? That is doing with this? I don't know. What's happening here? Okay. I'll come back to that in a second. Okay. Trash that order. Let's get a brand new order in. And if I can make it to 25, I'll make it to 25. What? What is this? What? Like, yes, you, that. There. 99? 99 of, what are you talking about? What? <laughs> station six. This is station six. I'm sorry. Why are you, is it because you have stuff inside you? No. What does station six do? Fenders. Station 6 does fenders. That's a very important job. Right? It is. This one has fenders. Oh, I see. Okay. We need to do this then. Okay. We need to readjust. We need to go like this. I know that car just got deleted. I get it. We need to do that. I think. This is so weird. <laughs> this is so unnatural. It feels weird. It feels so weird. Okay. 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 Yes. Okay, just 20, 25, please. <laughs> 25. Oh, God. Okay, this is real. Now we're really getting into the shits here. Okay, there we go. All right, I think we fixed the problem. So there's assembly station that needs to work on at least two of the tasks at hand. And that is this. Uh, let's go back to this. There we go. What is this? This is the trunk. 
So you got to be careful with that. Um, just because there's an assembly station and you can technically have a station for almost every single duty doesn't mean anything, I guess. Because they have to do some of the parts all at once, like the fenders and all that. You can't split that up. You have to do that all in one uh, line or one station. Are you good over here? Are you good? See, this is another example of it. What 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 is this one? What is this one? This is dashboard seating and steering. Yeah, see, you can't use all of that, I guess. Maybe I don't know. I'll keep my eye on it, but I don't think this is gonna work exactly how I thought it was going to, unfortunately. Okay, um, let's do the robots now. Let's do 100%. Whoops. There we go. 100%. Thank you very much. 100%. But yeah, it's not going to work as I thought. And maybe that's okay. Maybe it will just be fine how it is. Put a, quite a few in here. 15. Now, ideally, with all these new robots and new assembly station, the, the whole point of this is to make it, like, just be constant. And should, keyword, should never have any problems. And I guess the only problem that if it were to have is going to be a resource problem where they just don't have stuff in their stuff to do right they don't have anything to do like they don't have the the right stuff that they need that's going to be the only issue is going to be a supply issue i think that's what bottlenecks everything see like this this entire line at station five which is was it body frame body elements station five doesn't do anything <laughs> i guess it doesn't do anything with what it would you know i don't know sure it just doesn't do anything at all okay fair guess you don't have to do anything even though there is something on there like what was it uh fenders or something it was something body frame body frame is on station five but apparently we don't order anything for body frame maybe it just tinkers it just drives right through Station 5. So Station 5 does jack-ish. I think that's wrong. Uh, unused, sell all that, do that. Thank you. But yeah, I think, I think Station 5 just does nothing. Just absolutely nothing. How unfortunate <laughs> how unfortunate so it's like i still even have more i have more assemblies like uh I, yeah i have more assembly stations still in my back pocket that i haven't used yet but it's like what's the point what's the point it feels like i'm already done with everything there we go so that we got to reissue these real quick because these are out of date. Out of date. There we go. There we are. Bum, ba, da, da. I do want to take a, a look at it real quick when we get to that point, though. And just kind of see. See everything in action with this line. I do. I want to see how it's going. Part of me feels like it's not going well. But I mean, there's cars rolling out, so, you know, is it any better than what we already had before? I guess that's what my question is. Is it better than this line next to it? Is it running smoother? Is it going faster? What is it doing, right? Um, let's go here, get rid of that, do that. Oh, is this another line that isn't doing anything either? This is another line that isn't uh, doing anything either. Oh, God. Okay, let's do this one. Uh, 
There we go. Okay, so we have two lines in the entire assembly line. Two stations that don't do a single thing. They just exist to just exist. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Interesting indeed. Okay. We'll just refresh everything here. There we go. Twenty. We'll do twenty-five. Twenty-five. Thank you. And twenty-five. Interesting. Very, 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 very interesting. This is okay. This is entirely done. Okay, watching this from the get-go. Okay, so car started, car stopped, car is being worked on, as we see. Car worked on relatively fast. Good, good, good. Going good. Car stopped here. Worry a bit. Backlog. Why? Um, I guess it needs a mechanic to finish that job. Or what we do is we refresh the orders here. Okay, let's refresh the order. Oh, there's no suggested order for it. Well, what the hell? What does it do then? What is this? Since when has there been garbage in this game? Wait a sec. There has always been garbage. What the hell is happening in this game? Early access. Um... Order suggestions. There we go. Okay. Refresh this line so that it has everything that it needs. But the robot should be able to, to work on this car, I think, right? I'm going to go well above 25. Right? I think it should. Okay. All right. See, like now the, the you would think that the robot would be working now. There you go. Work now. You have one job. There you go. There you go. Perfect. And maybe the robots shouldn't work on the fenders. Maybe that's just what it is. Maybe the robot should do the simpler things. Maybe fenders is just too much for them. Because now look at this. This is bla well. Look at that. It's blazing, dude. Dunk dunk. Easy peasy. Thunk a thunk. Easy peasy. Or maybe I just need more robots on the line. Thunk a thunk. Done. Done. Can I get another car coming through here again? Let's just see. This is like more of a transport issue and a line issue now. Where it's like we probably don't have the resources at the moment. We just don't have the resources at the moment to cover this up here and we just have to wait we have to wait and we have to wait and we have to wait for the resources to come which is a bit of a bummer it is it is a bit of a bummer because uh there's nothing really we can do to manipulate this and i've tried we've tried right we've hired more transporters and honestly it's probably to the point where like you maybe shouldn't have this many assembly lines which is it's I get it. If having this many assembly lines is a lot, right? There's seven lines. It might be too many lines, of course. But I would like to, you know, think that they would hold it to a standard where, like, you could have as many lines almost as you want, in a way. Right? Yes, to some capacity, but I don't know if seven lines is what they were expecting for this game. <laughs> I'm not sure. Because uh, now all it is is just resource. Um, yeah, see? It's waiting on transporters to refill everything. I think this actually could be a, uh, this problem could be avoided in many different ways too. I think the advanced robots should have a bigger capacity. If you give them a bigger capacity rather than six, maybe just double their capacity to 12 for the most advanced, uh, robots. I think that solves a lot of problems. I have two suggestions. Increase double the uh, capacity for the highest tier robot from six to 12 and maybe 
have uh, have an NPC where they just do parking lot and attendee stuff, taking cars to the workshop, taking cars from the factory, stuff like that. That's my suggestions. Let me know what you think. That's all I got for you. Have a good rest of your day. This has been Car Manufacture. Do take care.